Hey, Lulu, what do you think? Am I ready for sharks and crabs? Ah! Hey, Explorers, I'm doing sharks and crabs with my friend Lulu, the shark, but the alarm scared her away. I wonder what's going on. Uh, more, more. You know that weird looking juice in the fridge you told me not to drink? I drank it. Uh-oh. Hey, Explorers! I'm joining Pocket Watches, the Big Green. Protecting our planet is super important because we only have one. So I'm doing my part by picking up litter, recycling, and stopping food waste, or whatever I can to keep our planet healthy and green. So take the Big Green Challenge with us. Lulu and her friends would really appreciate it. Cloudy, calm down. Ah, it's okay. How can I calm down? I'm turning into a shark, the worst thing on the face of the planet. You got it all wrong, Cloudy. Sharks are actually really cool. Yeah, did you know sharks are over 400 million years older than humans? Ah, scary shark! Ah, where? Aw, oh, Cloudy, you're scaring Lulu! And we're gonna be late for Sharks and Crafts! What are we making, Hayden? We're making shark fin headbands! Although, it looks like Cloudy won't need one. Ugh. You're going to need a headband, some cardboard from a cereal box, glue, a toothpick, a bucket for marbling, and your favorite nail polish colors! My favorite shark is the great white, the largest predatory shark in the ocean. So, I'm going to make it a gray and white marble headband. To start, we're going to cut the fin out of the cardstock. If you don't have cardstock, you could always use something like a cereal box. You need to cut two pieces so we can glue them together at the end. Remember, explorers, always have an adult help you with cutting. After the fins are all cut out, it's time to marble them. First, you're going to fill up your bucket of water about halfway, just enough so you're able to dip your fin. Then, you are going to take your different colors of nail polish and drizzle them in the water. I chose gray, blue, and white because I think great whites are the coolest. Did you know a great white shark can swim up to 60 kilometers per hour? Whoa, that's 10 times faster than a human. Now, take your toothpick and swirl the different nail polish colors together. That will create the marble effect. Now it's time for the dipping. Carefully take your fin and dip each side into the nail polish mixture, making sure to dip and remove very slowly. Take it out and voila, marbled fins. Next, we are going to glue the two pieces together, leaving about half an inch unglued at the bottom. Then you are going to take your scissors and cut a small hole right above the unglued section of the fin. This will be where we stick our headband through. Okay, now it's time for the last step, putting it on the headband. Once the nail polish has dried, Slide your headband through the hole we made earlier. Once it's in the center, spread the unglued flaps open. This will help the fin sit on your head. There we go, a marbled shark fin headband. Look, it even matches my tutu. Now we can be sharks together, Cloudy. Aw, oh, thanks, Hayden. I'd applaud, but... <laughs> I guess great white sound pretty cool. You still look kind of questionable to me. Oh man, I should have marbled mine. Hey, that must be a huge. Happy Shark Week! Whoa, Cloudy! You really went all out on your shark costume. <sighs> Ayush, what shark craft are you making? Obviously, I'm making. Shark slime! It's the best kind of slime there is! Ah, 
I love a good slime recipe. Ooh, shark slime. Okay, explorers, shark slime is pretty easy. All you need is a bottle of blue glitter glue, some baking soda, contact lens solution, and your favorite shark toys. First, you're gonna take a bottle of blue glitter glue and add that to your bowl. Ooh, so gooey! Next, you're gonna take half a teaspoon of baking soda and sprinkle that into your glue. Then, you're gonna add around one and a half tablespoons of contact lens solution. Finally, knead it all together. Sometimes it's too sticky, but don't worry. Just add more contact lens solution until the slime turns into the consistency you want. For the final touch, I'm adding some of these big shark gummies because my favorite shark is the whale shark. And they're the largest shark there is. And did you know whale sharks can live up to a hundred years? Whoa! That is like way older than my dad. Oh man, this shark slime is great. Why haven't I ever thought of shark slime before? I thought the whale shark sounded really cool. Yeah, see Cloudy, sharks can be awesome. All right, explorers, it's time for our last shark craft. After a long, hard day learning about sharks, it's time to enjoy a cold glass of shark lemonade. All right, explorers, first, let's check out our ingredients. We have a silicone ice cube tray, some water, shark gummies, lemonade mix, and blue food coloring. But before you make the actual lemonade, you're going to want to make the shark cubes first. Start by placing a shark gummy in each of your ice cube holes. Then, we're going to take some water and fill up the hole. If you want, you can even color the water with blue food coloring. Let those freeze for a couple of hours and then they'll be ready to go. Next, we are going to make our cool blue lemonade. So first, take a cup of your lemonade powder and put it into your pitcher. Then, we're gonna fill the pitcher up with water and stir. Bam! Lemonade! Easy peasy! Now, let's add our food coloring. Remember, just a drop goes a long way, explorers. Whoa! Okay, now the final step. Let's get our shark cubes from the fridge. Those turned out awesome! So take some of your shark ice cubes and add them to your glass. We'll add some blue lemonade. And let's add an umbrella, why not? Wow, explorers, look at that! Mmm, lemony goodness! You know, Marmar, woo woo, sharks aren't so bad. They're actually really awesome! Look! I can even breathe underwater! Yeah! Woohoo! Ooh, yum! Say baby shark did it did it do Say baby shark did it did it do Say baby shark Say mommy shark did it did it do Say mommy shark did it did it do Say mommy shark did it did it do Say mommy shark Say daddy shark did it did it do Say daddy shark did it did it do Say daddy shark did it did it do Say daddy shark Say grandma shark did it did it do Say grandma shark did it did it do Say grandma shark did it did it do Say grandma shark Say grandpa shark did it did it do Say grandpa shark did it did it do Say grandpa shark did it did it do Say grandpa shark 
save the sharks to do to do to save the sharks to do to do to save the sharks to do to do to save the sharks we can help to do to do to we can help to do to do to we can help to do to do to we can help we love sharks to do to do to we love sharks to do to do to we love sharks to do to do to we love sharks Look at that! You're turning back to normal! Oh man! I liked being a shark! <laughs> Cloudy! Bye, explorers! Explorers, it's important we learn and appreciate sharks during Shark Month. Lots of them are on the brink of extinction, which means we might not ever be able to see them again. But if we learn and appreciate their beauty, we might be able to save them. I'll see you next time. Bye, explorers.